Hey guys, how's it going? It's Target here. Welcome back to another episode of Player Builds, where I take a real NHL player and recreate them for your use in online team play, team play drop-ins and club games. Uh, on the menu today is an attainable player. This time we're going to be doing for the Boston Bruins their big power forward, Milan Lucic. So let's look in here and see how close I got him uh, to his actual appearance. Uh, left wing, beat him, built him as a left wing because Milan Lucic is a left winger. Alrighty. So, for the stick, he uses the Warrior Supreme Total, or sorry, the Bauer Supreme Total 1. For the skates, he uses also the Bauer Supreme Total 1. For the gloves, though, he uses the Bauer Vapor APX Pros. And for the helmet, he uses the Bauer 5100, okay? Information, all you need to know is he's 6'4", 235 pounds. Get ready for this guy. Uh, you might want to drop his weight down to 210, so he's actually a little bit mobile and you can still hit. Most importantly for hitting is height, so if you want to drop him down to 210, I would not be offended at all. Uh, head 5, skin tone 13, short hair, black in color, stubble for the facial hair, black facial hair color, uh, regular 2 for the eyebrows, make those black, brown eyes, no black eyes, scars, or freckles, uh, no visor, big shoulder pads, long pants, no jersey tuck, full sock tuck, and white stick tape, okay? And we'll pop over here and take a look at the attributes and the hockey shop so you can see exactly how we got Milan Lucic playing like Milan Lucic. And you'll find also that I actually gave him a boost on offense because we had extra points for the power forward, something that you don't necessarily get uh, in the defensive category, but that's okay. You'll end up so with, some, with a bonus here in the offensive. So let me go to my pro, and we'll go to edit attributes, and we'll edit our left winger. I'll show you the hockey shop first where you need your boost to go. Once it decides that it wants to go, we will do it. <laughs> God, this takes so long. All right, left wing. So hockey shot first, plus seven wrist shot power, plus seven wrist shot accuracy, and plus seven offensive awareness. We'll do plus seven speed, agility, and acceleration in that second row. Uh, plus seven strength, plus seven stick checking, and plus seven body checking. And finally, plus seven puck control, plus seven passing, and plus seven hand eye. All right. Let's take a look at the attributes now. So deking is the one thing that I did give a boost to. 85 deking. 87 hand-eye, 87 offensive awareness, 87 passing, 87 puck control. I put two extra into slap shot accuracy because I had some extra points to spend. Uh, wrist shot accuracy and power both at 87. This guy is pretty balanced in the offensive category. All at 87. You should be doing pretty well with those numbers. Uh, right wing, or sorry, not right wing, Jesus. Defense, aggressiveness at 87, body checking 95, defensive awareness 85, leave discipline and face-offs at stock. I put a little into fighting, but I think you don't need it. You should still be able to win fights without fighting skill. And then 85, stick checking, that'll give you a little bit of a boost there. Athleticism, he's only 84, acceleration and agility and speed, so you really got to time your hits properly. Balance is at 80, Durability is at 67, Endurance at 83, and finally Strength at 92. You should be knocking anybody down that comes within your range. You might get bumped down a little bit because you are only 80 balance, but that's okay. You'll be able to deliver more hits than you take them. So I hope you guys enjoy them. Let me know what you think. Uh, tell me down in the comments below if he was a good build or not. Don't forget to tell me who you want me to use next time for the player builds. So I'll leave you with that. Until next time, I'm Target Audience, and I'll catch you guys out on the ice.